Minecraft Pocket Edition. Uh, I haven't played too much of this. I actually thought the it was very limited compared to the normal Minecraft. Uh, like, let me show you here. Do, 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 create new world, so it's just like in the normal Minecraft. It's basically like Minecraft Classic, like um, when Minecraft is for sale and like the super super alpha days. Like this is all Minecraft was. It was just like the classic mode. You had like a a few blocks you can choose from, and you just play stuff infinitely. That's basically it. So I'm just gonna create a random world here. Uh, iPad. Because this is my first video I've made on an iPad. Oh shit, that's the world, the name of the seed. God damn it! You kind of see my face on my iPad a little bit. Whoa. So here we go. Okay, here. Control. It's like <laughs> it's like a first-person game on like a mobile device. Like I've never been too like thrilled about games on a first on a touch screen because it's just weird. Like look at the way I'm controlling with my hands. I have this thingamajig on the corner of the screen and then I just kinda drag my finger across whoa and then like after a while like you know you're just kinda rubbing your finger against like the the glass or whatever you call it on an iPad and you can just kinda get a little get a little burning sensation there like it's you're rubbing it raw I don't know how else to put that and so I guess I'll just destroy some blocks here it's, oh I, I can't get some wood because this is like creative mode see let's see here I can just choose from a bunch of different thingamajigs here. I can like get some wood, I can get some cobble. It looks like I can only have three blocks at a time. Oh. Uh, can I select this one right here? No. Uh Alright, back to game. I guess I select it here and then I choose the one I want to get rid of. So you have to get out of the menu. God damn it. <laughs> Bear with me here. And then brick. So I have some light blue wool, brick, and some glass. So let's make something out of that. Because that's all I can do. Hopefully you can, like, they'll add some survival stuff later on, but... It seems like it's all you can do for now. So how do you place a block? You gotta figure that out here. Oh, there you go. So I guess, like, it's a tap. You just tap where you want to place a block. And then you just place it there. And then to jump, I guess it's just this middle button right here. This middle button. Boing, boing. Boing. Okay, so let's just let's try and get a decent house going here. Oh yeah, and to jump and stuff, like you don't really have to press a button to jump. Uh, you just walk up to where you want to jump to, and it'll just do it automatically. I think there is a button that you can press. Oh yeah, duh, it's this one. <laughs> I'm not even listening to myself talk. Like I hear myself, I just say stuff, and I don't even remember. So I guess I'll just make a nice brick platform here. Let's get rid of this flower. Oh shit, I accidentally got rid of some dirt too. I gotta place two there. Oh god. Place that there. Oh no, I fell! Gotta get back on here at these controls! Ugh, gotta get used to them! Like, I guess this could be some fun when you have nothing else to do. Like, you're waiting, like, in an airport or something, you have your phone. Or, like, you're on a plane or something. Or you're just going somewhere and you don't have any access to internet or a computer. God damn it, now I gotta destroy this brick block. See, it's not like the normal creative mode in Minecraft, where like you'll just destroy everything instantly. Some blocks will take a lot longer to destroy, but they won't like take super long like obsidian in the normal Minecraft. Like I'll get some obsidian in a sec. Alright, let's get let's get rid of this wool because I don't know why I had that particular color of wool. Okay, so I got some obsidian, and let's place some obsidian and then try to destroy it. Oh no! Okay, see, it takes a little longer. But not too long, not terribly long. That would suck. It's like, hmm, just having my finger right here, just breaking stuff. Whoops, I'll place some obsidian right there. Hmm, I'm actually gonna see if I can go to the nether. I don't think, actually, wait. No, there's not even flint and steel, <laughs> so there's no way I can get to the nether. There is no fire because I'm assuming uh, the hardware for mobile devices can't handle the fire or something. I don't know. It's probably just a performance issue. I'm gonna go ahead and make one. I pretend that I'm gonna go to that other. I'm gonna try and make one of these controls. Okay. Okay. So. Uh. <laughs> Here we go. Now I'll place one there. Jump! Aha! Place one there. Aha! 
and oh shit, how much higher? There and there. Okay, how many is that high? Is that four high? Oh, there we go, sweet. Now if I just had some fire, I can make something cool and oh, go to another. Maybe I can get some orange wool. There's no orange wool? Are you kidding me? I guess I'll get some gold. Alright, what am I doing? I'll get the purple wool. What am I doing? Not orange. I was thinking about the fire that you needed to have for the the thingamajig, the nether portal. No, it's purple. There we go, fake nether. Yeah. All right, let's go. Some, let's actually build a house. It's all you can do. It's all you can do is build a house. Great. So uh, I guess I can make this a little bit bigger. Dun dun, dun dun, dun dun dun. Oh shit! No. I'll break you. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> Little finger. <laughs> boom, 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 boom. A little bigger. God damn it. <laughs> it's so much more tedious to place blocks. Actually, when you, when you have like a bunch of areas, like places in sight, it can actually be pretty easy. Bang, 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 bang. Look at that. Bang. Uh, oh, oh, there we go. Bang, bang, bang. Bang, bang. Yeah. Bang, bang, bang. Bang, bang, bang. Oh, no! Oh, now my nether portal's gonna get in the way. Oh, God. Bang, bang. Alright, I think that's. I don't think I need to make a super big house. I think I will make use a different material for my wall. So let's do this. Yeah, I, want, I definitely want an update for this game. This is alpha. Kinda alpha. Whenever wool was added, basically. Let's get some. This is kinda weird. What am I doing here? I got like a brick uh, floor, then I have wood walls. Isn't that like usually the opposite? A wood floor and then a brick wall? Whatever. This is the opposite house. It's a funky house for some funky controls on a funky device. Bum, bum, dun, dun. For a funky video. On a funky channel. In a funky world! Yeah! In a funky universe. Dun, dun, dun. Dun! Okay, I don't have a door. Uh, let's make a door. What am I doing? I just, I just use my, my middle finger for everything. I'm just like, fuck you, game! Fuck you! Fuck you! Fuck you! Okay. Uh, get some glass there. Get out of here. It's gotta get used to that menu thing here. Jump up here. Can I make doors in this game? I'll have to check. I don't think I can. Right, I'm gonna see if I can jump across here. This is gonna be difficult. Uh, huh! Yeah, I did it! <laughs> Let's make that one higher. There we go. Got my outline for the door. Need to place one more block. Do I have to? Oh no, I don't. All right, now let's just place the glass. Oh God, don't fall. Dun dun. Oh no! What the heck? It doesn't make glass breaking sounds. Wow. Oh no! <laughs> oh no! God damn it! Right, I, I guess I can use this time, this opportunity to. I just realized there's a lot of mushrooms right here. Ookadooks! Guess that could be my entrance. A wooden entrance to a brick floor house. Cool!